Hi guys, welcome to my current favorites. Um, so I'm gonna go for a few of my beauty favorites as well as a few random favorites. So I'm gonna start off with my favorite lip combination right now. It's a combination of the MAC Lipstick in Whirl and the Lime Crime Velveteen Matte Lipsticks in Bleach. So basically what I've been doing is um, I'll apply a layer of Whirl um, all over and then it within the inner parts of the lips, I'll dab on um, bleach. Make sure I blend it all in. And then what that gives is a very like pretty peachy nude color that lasts, like literally lasts all day. So yeah, I've been loving that combination. And then the next thing I've been loving is the Urban Decay Brow Beater in Dark. So what I've been loving using this for is because it has a really fine nib and so I find that like when it comes to like finishing the brows like you know just making sure all the lines are like straight and pointy like this has helped because it's because the tip is so fine um so I've been using this a lot as a more of a, like a finishing touch for the brows so the next thing is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. It's probably a bit too light for me right now because I am a bit tanned. I've been loving wearing this. It's a medium. It's a medium to high coverage foundation, and um, it stays matte like a, for at least a good like four to six hours for me. Uh, my my skin does get quite oily quite easily, but I find that this is um it's, this does stay matte on me a bit longer. The next one is um, China Glaze. Um, nail polish in pool party. I find that whenever I am a bit tan and it's summer, I always go for I always go for this nail polish because it's just this perfect summer bright in your face kind of orange, um, like bright neon orange color. So I've been loving that. So a final makeup favorite for me is the um, Kiko um, Desert is the Kiko Desert Dunes Baked Bronzer in in um, warm. Melange? Melange? I think that's how you pronounce it. So it's a very um, warm, peachy, golden um, bronzer. It's very slight shimmers. It's, re it's like, it's really, really finely milled. Um, so beautiful. I use this more as a like all over bronzer or even as a blush. It gives a very natural um, peachy glow. So I've been loving this. And, you know, Kiko is just, it's for, for, its, for the price. Like this is neat. this is absolutely like amazing. So moving on to some skincare favorites, I have been absolutely loving this um, Bobbi Brown Extra Balm Rinse. So a friend of mine actually recommended this to me, and she absolutely like sold it to me because like I think the next I think I bought it like literally the next day um, after like she told me about it. Basically, what what this is is a conditioning um, cleanser. It is um the in terms of like the texture, it re reminds me of like like Vaseline or something. So I basically scoop out like pea sized amount and then massage it into my dry skin and then making sure I really work it all in. Amazing thing about this is as you're massaging it in, it actually heats up a little bit. So it actually is, so it's like really, it's for me at least, like it's really relaxing, like, you know, on top of the citrusy sand and the warmth. It's like such a relaxing thing, like especially you know, you're about to go to bed, you're about to like, you know, wash off all your makeup. This is like the perfect relaxing thing. So after massaging it in for about like a minute or so, you then, um, you can then make it into like a, almost like a milky consistency by, by activating it, <clears throat> by activating it with some water. So uh, that just makes sure that you're really like melting off all the makeup that you've been wearing all day. Um, so. I've been loving this because like so the reason why I got this was my friend told me that it really helped her skin like it really transformed her skin in terms of um, getting rid of blackheads minimizing the pores and like brightening the complexion and that is so true like I've been using this for about three weeks now maybe almost almost a month and I can say that like definitely there are less blackheads around my nose like and then even like the pores on my cheeks and on my forehead have um, minimized um I am also using a few other things that I'll probably I'll talk about in just a second but I think that this has really helped my skin
so I've been loving this. It is quite expensive, but for the amount that you need to use, um, you know, for the amount that you need to use every time, I think like this huge massive top will probably last me a good six six months. If you're looking for um, a cleanser or even like a makeup remover, highly highly recommend this. So my last skincare favorite is this um, quarterly instant detox mask. I actually got this like on a whim, like I was like looking around um, for a new cleanser and then I saw this and I was like, oh that sounds quite interesting. I just ran out of my Origins um, charcoal I can't remember the name, like the black, the charcoal mask. Um, so I needed a new sort of clay mask type. So what I like about this is that um, it's easy to remove. What I hate about the Origins um, charcoal mask is that like once it's dry, it takes so long to wash it off. Like that is my least favorite part. But this, um, like it's so was so like it's so easy to wash off and tightens the pores and draws out the impurities and brightens um, the complexion. So I've been really loving this, and the scent is really nice. It's really um refreshing. I believe majority, if not all, of Cordelie's products are um grape based, so they all smell of this like amazing like vineyard type smell. I think that's how vineyards smell. I'm not sure, but it all smells great. Um yeah, so. Uh, if you're looking for a new mask, you can check this out. What other favorites have I got? Um, Orange is a New Black, the new season. I have loved season four. Like, season three was a bit boring, but season four, like, was really good. Like, especially the last two episodes, like, that that really got me. I don't think I've ever cried watching um, Orange is a New Black, but on, but that one episode really got to me <laughs> but yeah I've been loving that so my last favorite is ta-da <sighs> guys this is possibly the best ice cream bar I have ever tasted in life like salted caramel anything is amazing but like this salted caramel ice cream bar from haagen -Dazs. oh my god it is just oh <sighs> you can take myself i just no words i'm trying so hard not to eat this right now if you can find this anywhere near you grab it eat it enjoy it because it's fucking amazing so that's it for my current favorites if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos bye what kind of party can you go with this? Makeup? Every party. Oh, Halloween. <laughs> yeah, that's where it is. <laughs>